All right, Willy Wagpecker, you win. I sent a neuron message to Lisa to fly over right away. She should be here in a few minutes. Splendid, Mr. Miles. She will enjoy her marriage to the great king of the Dickens. Look, I only did it to save Topper. You promise when she gets here, you'll let him go, right? Yes, Mr. Miles, you have my word. But first, Lisa must be examined by the royal physicians. Are those the doctors? They will administer a hormone that would eliminate the menopause. She will be able to birth a royal heir every year until she is 90. Oh, look, a spaceship is coming out of hyperdrive. It's a wedding party. Oh, that's the best man. And those are the party guests. It looks like they've already injected the wedding party narcotic. Extra strength fentanyl. Who's that next to my car? Oh, that is His Royal Highness, the Great King of the Dickens. Isn't he cute? No, he's not cute. He's not cute at all. He's about to rehearse the Royal Fertility Dance. He's swollen with pride. You know, I can't see him from here. Um, why don't you have him dance on top of my car? Are you sure that your car doesn't have a security system that will zap anyone who gets on top of it? Well, now that you mention, I guess maybe it does. I kind of forgot about that. I'll turn it off right now. He, he can still dance on my car. That's very good, Mr. Niles, because if something had happened to his majesty, Papa Redbone would suffer.